What is going on guys, it's Techno here, and today I just want to bring you a hardcore TDM match. Uh, if you liked the beginning of the video, that was a montage of my friend Logan getting some pretty awesome uh, headshots, and he's really good with the sniper, so I told him I'd make a montage and put it at the beginning of my video. If you can, please direct your attention to the top right corner. I want to bring you my class setup. I am bringing you the Razorback with optical zoom, quick draw, the RK5 as a secondary, I'm running a Simtex grenade, two EMPs, ghost, and I'm using tracker to see where my enemy's footsteps if you just saw a minute ago, and I'm also using gung ho to aim faster after sprinting. Now, I apologize for not having a video up yesterday. Um, I kind of got busy with New Year's stuff, and I hope everyone had a safe and happy New Year's Eve and a very, very great New Year's Day. Um, but I had originally planned for this video to go up yesterday, but thing is, my DVR that I used to record gameplay I just didn't send it, uh, send the file, I should say, to my computer in time for me to edit and to have it uploaded. So I do apologize, um, but the topic that I want to talk to you guys about in today's video is bad spawn points. Now I was going to use originally a Nuketown uh, gameplay that I had, but I saw no need for that when I got this game. Uh, in this game you'll see that in little parts of it that I die and I spawn not that far away from where I died originally. Now that has actually happened a lot to me in this game not necessarily in this video but in a lot of other lobbies it really happens a lot now I really just want to say that Treyarch if you guys put out Black Ops 4 or whatever please fix the spawning system to where you don't spawn where you just die I mean I'm glad I went positive in this game but I mean it's ridiculous and it's not just in hardcore, it's also in core. Now, one thing I want to talk about is I have actually found out that I do a lot better in core than I do in hardcore, which is weird. Um, so I thought about maybe just bringing you guys a little hardcore gameplay instead of regular core TDM or kill confirm. But uh, yeah, I mean, Treyarch, if anybody up there is listening to this commentary, please, please fix the spawning system I and I get like a little good uh, little streak going here for me while I'm red screened but I really just want to like really push that um, because I also have been told that these spawns for World War 2 are also just as equally bad now the top two things that I hear when I'm new Call of Duty drops is the maps are bad or the spawning system sucks or you know hit detections horrible those three things seem to be the most consistent thing that i keep hearing and you would think that the developers of these games would have heard at least somebody's cries out for help but i guess they just i guess they just think it's either funny i don't know if they're trying to troll us or what but i i'm being you know just completely guessing here but uh i do manage like i said to go positive in this gameplay but it wasn't really easy i found that i have to play more strategically and defensively to go positive and i'm not sure why that is because i love to rush like i like to play uh kind of fast paced because to me you know when making a video it's not going to be fun just seeing me sit in the corner camping aiming down sight at a door the entire gameplay that's that's not fun for me that's i, I don't even think anybody would watch a video like that so i love to rush around get kills get score streaks and i don't know if i'm like playing too aggressive or or what but I really had to play defensive this this day that I was playing. This wasn't just this lobby. It was a bunch of other lobbies I was having to play ag aggressive 
and then switch from aggressive to defensive just so I can get maybe one or two score streaks. I think I was running the higher score streak, so I don't really think I get any in this gameplay, sadly. But um, it seems to be a lot harder to be getting a lot of the harder score streaks. Now, I'm not really sure what um, what some of the pro players do to you know get those high-end score streaks, but I really don't even know if it's really worth it because in order for me to at least be a good player, you would need to get a lot of points. Not really, oh, I need to get all these kills or anything, but I would rather have, <clears throat> excuse me, that I would rather have um, so, so many points. And this dude is like completely spawn camping or whatever, but if you did see, you know, there earlier, I was killed and then I spawned not that far away from the, the barn. So, and that's, I think that's the only time it happened in this map, but in maps for say, Nuketown, it's just, it's, it's horrible, it's worse, it's more consistent. Now, you see me really make a bad decision here, but I end up paying off for me. You know, I saw this guy camping over there, and I see that he's changed corners. Lucky for me, he has bad aim, and I go around, and I was able to get him. Usually, if they are camping, I try not to, but this dude, I guess, just really pissed me off that day to where I had to go around and get him. Um, but... Yeah, I mean, Treyarch, fix the game, the spawns, please, if you put out Black Ops 4. And I hopefully will be having World War II gameplay not that far along. But the game's coming to a close. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And uh, as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.